Jaya Balan, uh, specialist in uh, occupational health. Anyway, Dr. P. Jaya Balan. I've got two parts. One part is a very simple video lasting about five minutes. Uh, the second part is some briefs uh, in my way of power. Okay. Uh, let me first, before I start, uh, tell you that uh, rare earths are not rare earth. A lot of people, in fact, doctors are also confused. They kept asking me, keep asking me, what's the problem with rare earth? Actually, rare earths are not radioactive. The problem with the rare earth, and why you call it rare, rare is because it's intimately connected with the transuranics of which you have got thorium-1, the other one is uranium, and others. Because it is intimately connected to, to uh, what you call these transuranics, you tend to call them rare earths, they are not really rare, they are virtually ubiquitous, you get them more. You get it in Kerala, you get it in Brazil, Kerala, India, you get it in Malaysia, you get it all over. And because it has become such a valuable commodity, uh, it started with uh, Mitsubishi trying to do it in our backyard because uh, rare earth processing was banned or rather prohibited by 1984 in Japan, uh, 74, sorry, and they decided to locate it here in Bukit. Uh, recently, well, I can't get it going. Can you get it going? Just, just a minute. Uh, while uh, there was some, I was handling some media. Uh, one of the last media person from Australia told me it appears as if the script from Bukit Meira is being rewritten in quantum lines. That's true. It's virtually being rewritten, and I'll start with the video.